Hi everyone. We're going to solve this inequality by graphing. So um, the first thing we're going to do is just know that this is x squared and that we're shifting it up by 4. So if you did just x squared, it would look like something like this. We go up um, 1, 2, 3, 2 goes to 4. But we're shifting everything up by 4. So from here, shift up 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, and do the same thing. You go up 1, 1, and then from here you're going to go 2 to 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Gives you a better, it's symmetric about um, the x equals 0. So here's your graph. Looks something like this. Your y-intercept is 4. It doesn't have any x-intercepts. All right. Now, it says y is less than. It also says equal, so that's why it is a solid line. So the good rule of thumb for this, this is the easiest way, is you just put your um, pen or pencil on any point on the curve, and it says less than, you draw down. If I put it here, I draw down. If I put a point here, I draw down. So basically, the shading occurs... Uh, outside, not inside of the curve. And it would be all of this, any of this. Another way to do is to uh, check uh, points. So we could check, let's see, 5 comma 0. Uh, I mean 0 comma 5. And see if that's true. So if 5 is 5 less than or equal to 0 squared plus 4. And 5 is not less than or equal to 4. So this point wouldn't work. Or you could pick another point. Let's pick, uh, I like the, the 0 ones. Let's pick this point, which we're saying is the solution. And that point is 0, 2. So let's check it. Um, we have 2. Is 2 less than or equal to 0 squared plus 4? Is 2 less than or equal to 4? Yes. So this point works. So that's another way to check it. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.